name is Natalia and welcome to Advanced Markets blog. Today I'd like to talk to you about UK FCA register and how you can verify your brokerage information through this online resource. Verify what permissions it has, what type of clients it can accept, and what trade and name it operates under. MIFID II is pushing for transparency, disclosure, and fair trading conditions. In this world of ever-evolving financial regulations, it is still surprising to see many companies and clients ignoring the counterparty risk, which is one of the biggest risks that any financial company can face. If you fail to check your business partner, you may be looking at uncovered financial liabilities very quickly. And that is why I wanted to go through the UK FCA register with you today and show you how to verify whether or not your partner holds appropriate regulatory license. So let's start with step-by-step -step guide. Step one, locate the URL of the UK FCA financial register and search your company by name or the license number if available. The first thing I want you to take a note of is whether the company is financially licensed through FCA UK regulatory authority or it's authorized by another country in the European Union. If the company is authorized in the UK, you will see the following under the status module along with the principal place of business address. And if the company is authorized in another country and is passported or has a branch, you will see EEA authorized as you can see on the screen here. One other thing I want you to take a note of is what type of clients the broker can accept. The reason why I'm bringing this to your attention is because in the FX world, a lot of brokers claim to be institutional. However, it is important to note that a lot of them have roots in the retail space. In order to verify whether or not the brokerage can hold retail or professional clients, go to the module Permissions section Arranging Deals and Investments. As you can see on the screen, there are a couple of examples. So one brokerage is able to accept retail and institutional clients, and the other one is able to accept professional accounts only. Is your broker an STP broker or is it a market maker? In order to verify whether or not your brokerage is STP or has market maker permissions, go to the module called Permissions. Subsection Dealing and Investments is Principal. If your broker is only able to conduct agency model, you will see a limitation listed in the section called Matched Principal. Another thing you should be aware of is all the brand names that your broker can operate under. Go to the section Trade and Brand Names and verify all the other names that this brokerage company can be utilizing. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you'd like to download FCA UK fact sheet, please follow the link.